what's going on? I tell you what's going on. Leicester have announced their new manager. Yep. It's not Scott Parker. It's not Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. It's not Dean Smith. And it's not a returning name either. It's not Martin O'Neill. Oh no. No, 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 no. It's not Ranieri. Not Nigel Pearson. I tell you who the manager is. It's Pep Guardiola. Right hand man. <laughs> not quite Pep. Yeah, that's right. Manchester City's assistant manager or assistant coach, whatever you want to call it these days, Enzo Maresca. So, Marca to Enzo Maresca. On a serious note, if that chant goes round the ground, I probably will cry. Um, he is now the full manager at Leicester City, and I'm loving it. Scott Park was at the ground yesterday, apparently, according to sources, and didn't commit to the idea of what the club wanted. I'm not quite sure what that means. I interpret it as that he probably couldn't get enough um, money for transfers. I'm not sure. Um, but whatever the weather, no Scotty Parker and no £1,350 Primark cardigans um, for for the games on Saturdays in the Championship for us. But what we might have is a bit of Pep ball. Now, let's hope that he's learned something off Pep, who's, give or take, the best manager in the world. They've just won the Champions League. They've won a treble, and he'll be leaving that side to come to Leicester City. Um, he might not have a James Madison, though, because reports come in that uh, Tottenham Hotspur have just thrown a £55 million bid for the central midfielder. Um, obviously, he's going to be with England squad this week on the England duty. So, time will tell on James Madison's future with the club. Leicester do not have to sell him, but probably risk the... I think it's a risk not to sell him with the amount of money that's involved because he probably will go for free next season. Unless Leicester get Premier League football and win the championship or get promoted in some form, maybe that might keep you know, Madison from from going and, and you know, looking at it a different way. But I, I really, I can't I can't see it, to, my, to be honest. I, can just, I can't see it. So, I wonder what Leicester have said to Maresca um, for this deal of his. I wonder if, if they've, he, they've given him a budget he can spend or if he can work with players to come back from, from loans out, like George Hurst. I mean, obviously, Will Alves is uh, is on in a serious situation with his uh, with his ACL, so I don't know when he's actually going to return. Um, and there's a few of us out on loan as well. Don't forget. So maybe he's going to work with some of the youth and get the get the youth in and and get. There's a lot of dead wood gone. There's a lot of players gone. You know, we've lost six players I think uh, in total so far, and plus Tete who's gone. So he's got a lot. He's got a lot of. Um, kinks to work out i suppose with this squad of what's left will jamie vardy stay is he going we don't know he's got i think he's got about 11 months on his contract still so technically he can stay but i i don't think it's about just jamie vardy i think there's a, a lot more to it it's like keeping kdh and keeping maybe wilfred and Didi, who looked terrible last season but it looked not great really for the last 18 months i don't know if Indeed, he's even the right kind of man, really, for, for pep ball, so to speak. Um, maybe we could pull in Calvin Phillips or something on loan from Man City. Maybe that's what Maresca could do. Uh, I'd love to see that happen. I don't think it's going to. But at this time, obviously, we know very little. But what we do know is that he he is the right-hand man. Arteta has done fantastic at Arsenal um, over the last two and a half years. He's been there, maybe three um, and now Maresca is the second to Pep, you know, in this current form. So we might get a very, we might get, we might get a very good manager. It might not work, but I think I would rather take this than Scott Parker, and I'd rather take this than than Dean Smith and and John Terry. It didn't work. I probably didn't have long enough to be honest with you, but. Something, something, 
exciting about this this move. Right, I'm all out of time. I'm at gymnastics picking page up. Uh, if you remember, there's a alternative to this video that's just going to be uploaded at the same time. So if you remember, there's a members only video pop, popped up right now. Um, make sure you hit the subscribe button and smash the likes on the video and follow me at Lee underscore Chappie on all socials. And I shall see you down the road. See you in a bit. Never quit.